Hallelujah, glory to God. You are welcome to prophetic intercession with Amel. It's always an honor each time I am led to give you prophetic messages. If this is the first time you're seeing me, God bless you and thank you so much for stopping by. I pray that God will use this channel to minister to you prophetically, to tell you the mind of God and help you know God better in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. This person is angry at you because they said you lied to them. They are angry because you said you lied to them. And this might push you to want to say something that you are naturally not even supposed to tell them. There are things about your life that are supposed to be your covenant secret. It is not for public consumption. It doesn't matter who the person is to you or how dear they are. They are your covenant secret you're supposed to keep to yourself. This is something that Samson did not understand. He did not understand that as a Levite, he was supposed to hold his covenant secret dearly to him. And sometimes I don't really understand what could have happened because it did not happen once. He lied about it to Delilah the first time. Delilah spoke about it to others and, and they tried to use it against him. But thank God it was a lie. So you might say, um, how come, why did Samson do that? But in our daily lives, it happens all the time. You tell someone something very special about you and you get to hear it from another person and you still go ahead to trust another person to tell them something that is so personal to you. You've got to learn not to trust people with your covenant secrets. You've got, got to learn how to love people without entrusting them with such because you do not know when friends become enemies. Yeah, that is the sad reality. Sometimes friends become enemies and they are going to use those things you told them as a weapon against you. Learn to keep your covenant sacred, sacred. Do not tell anyone. Samson trusted Delilah to the point of telling her what his sacred was. No razor is supposed to touch his hair as a Levite, as a priest. And Delilah used that against him to bring him down. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. God will give you wisdom in your dealings, even with the people you love. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.